Roblox YouTubers are going missing. I know, who would have ever guessed? Literally, I'm not even joking here. People are deleting their channels, people are disappearing, and I'm gonna get straight into it. So, first of all, RTC shout out to them because this is how I know about this information. YouTube going limited has deleted all of their videos. Limited made trolling videos. It seems they have probably left the Roblox community for good. So this was their channel. They had 250,000 subscribers. They were vertified. Now, as you can see, this is their channel completely. At the bottom there, it says this channel has no new content or well, it has no videos at all because what they've done is they've either deleted them or set them to private. Now on their social blade, as you can see, this one kind of hurts. The last 30 days, they lost 25 million views because obviously once you delete it from a YouTube channel or you private the video, it's no longer like public. So the social blades that tracks like analytics and things, it can no longer track that. So all those views have technically just been like, been like erased from the channel. 25 million views. That is, that's a lot of views, all right? Take it from me, that is a lot of views. My name's View, I know views. They have also deleted their Twitter. So not only have they deleted their YouTube channel, their Twitter has been deleted as well. Kind of crazy how they can just erase everything that they've done. They had a Twitch channel. Now, if you know what Twitch is, it's a streaming service where you can live stream. They had a Twitch channel and that is completely gone as well. Deleted. A fan, I believe, has said context on who he is. He was in Pink Ants videos and is one of his close friends that blew up with him. So apparently he was friends with Pink Ant, who's a big YouTuber. And yeah, it's crazy. I mean, he has the same amount of subscribers I have and he's just completely deleted his channel. Now, I never watched his videos, but apparently he did trolling videos, which is pretty interesting. Now, I do know Roblox doesn't particularly like them sort of videos, especially if you're in the star program, like they usually try and crack down and make sure that those sort of videos aren't actually a thing because it kind of promotes the wrong image that Roblox wants to show. But yeah, I mean, a madness. That YouTube has disappeared. And to be honest, we can't even see why because he deleted all his like social media. So if you know anything about him or that YouTuber, let me know. There are also are some other YouTubers that have disappeared. Once again, shout out to RTC Twitter account. YouTuber Chris and the Mike, which is one person, I believe. A popular jailbreak YouTuber has gone black. I believe that me. I, I'm pretty sure he meant blank. He's deleted all his videos or has made them gone private. Fans are worried for what's next. So as you can see, Chris the Mike, another YouTuber. This is him. He has the verified check mark and his subscriber count was actually privated, but we can see in the social blade on how many subscribers he, he did have before it went private. Now, this is interesting because this is actually a husband and wife. I've not mentioned Asher, Ashley, Ashley O'City just yet, but that's another YouTuber that's gone blank. These two were a couple. They were husband and wife, husband and wife YouTube duo. How, how sweet, right? They have deleted... Well, I say deleted, they've privated all their videos, they've, they've gone missing basically. Here we can see the Ashio City's channel, zero content on it now. It obviously used to have videos on, but of course they've either privated or deleted all their videos. Channel has no content. It definitely did have content because we're going to show the social blade in a second. Chris in the mic, there's his channel, no content. Okay, so just before we get into the social blade, there's this information that's quite interesting. Ashley City has retired her YouTube channel. Thank you for the support. So yeah, just out of the blue, just completely retired the YouTube channel. Deleted videos, poof, gone. And on the husband's channel, which I believe they were husband and wife. I'm not 100% sure on that. They could have been, I know they were together, but I don't, I'm pretty sure they were husband and wife. <laughs> that, that's not 100% fact. Chris and the mic, 2010, he was established. And his actually says change incoming. So maybe he could be coming back, Chris and the Mike. He's gone for now, as you can see, zero videos and stuff. But uh, maybe, maybe he could be back. Now, on the social blade, this is where it gets absolutely nuts. So for Ashley O'City's YouTube channel, this is just her channel, 231 million views were taken away. Because obviously, like I explained before, you delete, you private, you unlist, it takes it off public so this like analytic tracker can't see them so yeah a total of 200 231 million views that's that's a lot of views man that is so many views and of course we can actually see their subscriber count there it says one one million well just over one million actually so they she would have hit the one million mark 
probably got a plaque and then was like, yeah, I mean, I'm done. I'm done with YouTube. And then this is Chris and the Mike's YouTube channel, 461 million, which by the way, if you're not into YouTube or, or whatnot, that, I mean, that many views, that would be like millions, okay? That would be millions and millions of like ad revenue from just those views alone. And if this guy had like merch or whatever, you know, that is absolutely nuts. How much money and how much, you know, view, you know, how, how much he would have gotten from these views. So if you just take them off, the internet is kind of crazy. Chris and Ashley have become parents. So this is kind of the reason why they have came, why they have come off the internet. Chris and Ashley have become parents. Not that weird. They've retired from YouTube and they're going to spend time with each other and the baby. That is from a fan, I believe. Scrubby dog. So Ashley has actually, unlike the first YouTuber that was going limited, who's literally completely disappeared. No one knows what's happening with him. At least Ashley O City and Chris the Mike have still got their Twitter accounts so we can actually have an update on what's happened to them. Having a child has made me so passionate about childhood well-being and development that I'm going to go back to school and study child development and psychology. So yeah, uh, I can't. you can't really blame them to be honest. I mean, they've had a kid and that's why they've gone off YouTube. So I mean, really fair play to them, you know. Yeah, I kind of mentioned that they were getting so much money from the views, but life is not all about views and money. You know, it's if that's what they want to do to be happy, then really you can't blame them at all. And I'm, I'm happy for them. Being a YouTuber was fun, but I never felt like I was making a real difference in society by distracting kids from their issues with entertainment. I want to help kids fix their issues from the inside so they can grow into well-functioning adults. That's what Ashley said. I mean, you know, you, you can't really... <laughs> Like, you can clearly see that Ashley's a, a very nice person who, who wants to do good in the world, so fair play to her. I've had so much childhood trauma and spent so much of my life healing and want to help other children heal too. I remember how alone I felt as a kid and how I wanted just any adult to notice me and save me. I want to be that adult for other kids because I know how it feels. So yeah, I think it got like kind of a, a sad turn at the end there, but I'm happy that Ashley and Chris the Mike is doing what they love. But I must say though, is uh, I, I don't really understand why. I, the only part of this that I'm a little bit confused is why they would hide the videos, why they would like erase their progress on YouTube. That's the only bit that kind of seems a bit weird. Like I get they'd come off to go have like a kid and whatnot, but why would they remove the videos, you know? Cause they could still be, they, dude, with 500 million views, they could still be earning money like years to come. You know, those videos can stay on the YouTube platform forever and they literally don't need to do anything. They'd be earning revenue and they'd still be, you know, entertaining kids and whatnot on the YouTube platform for years to come. But of course they've decided to take it off the platform, which I, I mean is completely their decision. And yeah, maybe they just wanted to completely erase everything, like maybe because you never know, these people probably done YouTube for like 10 years, you know, and they're just sick of it. They want to just get off social media. They want to completely erase everything they've ever done, which is pretty much what they've done, and just wanted to start a new family life, which I guess fair play to them. And uh, I, I, I truly do wish them the best.